Right. Hispanics love movies that everybody else loves. They love them a bit more, thank God. Um, but big popcorn movies are huge in the Hispanic audience, but so is everything else. And, and all the different genres work. And so what we're afraid of in the cinema business is that we're shrinking the number of movies we're releasing to cinemas. Uh, part of this is the globalization of the market. You know, we're right here in the belly of the biggest distributor of movies in the world at Warner Brothers, and the majors are releasing fewer titles on bigger budgets. And, they're, and they're, they're condensing the themes and the genres because they want it to work everywhere in the world. And a movie's got to work in Russia and China and Brazil just as it works in North or South America. Um, and that's limiting the type of movies that we can have. And this is, this is bad for our Hispanic audience, it's bad for all of our audiences. So what we're championing at NATO is a way to try to keep diverse movies coming into our cinemas. And by diverse, I mean diverse in every possible way. Diverse by who's in the movie, diverse by what the themes are, diverse by how we're marketing it, um, diverse by the calendar dates and which month it's being distributed in so that we can give more choices to our consumers. Fortunately, on the, on the diversity point for Hispanics, Hispanics are well represented in the elements of movie making. If you think about the major, major directors, one of whom is right here at the table, Guillermo del Toro, Alfonso Cuarón, <laughs> Roberto Rodriguez, we got some big talent in this business. And if you look on the screen, the number of the, the leading Hispanic actors and actresses is, is voluminous. So we're actually in a better position with the Hispanic audience, maybe because they come so often, uh, in diversity in who's putting on the movies as we are in other places. I want more women on the screen. I want more women directing. I want more African-Americans on the screen. Last year we had four or five big African-American titles, and lo and behold, the African-Americans outperformed uh, other ethnicities last year because of the movies. Um, and so all kinds of diversity is great. Uh, to go back to the woman point for a minute, and I'll get off my soapbox. I don't understand why, if women buy 52% of the tickets in this country and even more overseas, uh, we got 18% of the major directors in this town uh, who are women. Uh, I don't understand why 33% of the speaking roles uh, in movies are women. And this is Hispanic women, non-Hispanic women, women across the board. So diversity would help us sell tickets. And at, at least Hollywood's got diversity right on Hispanics generally, but we got it wrong in so many other ways. So. All, all forms of diversity help drive uh, ticket sales and uh, give people more to watch, and we're pushing aggressively.